Trained service dogs can be a lifeline for people with vision loss, but the training takes a long time and it can be very expensive. Now researchers say they have the answer. Robot canines. Fox's Lauren Green has a story. In the near future, robotic dogs could replace actual canines as service animals for people who are blind and visually impaired. That's the vision of researchers at the Swiss Federal Institute of Technology. They're busy customizing a four-legged bot to see how well it can safely navigate people who can't see. The team outfitted the robo-dog with special room mapping sensors, which use cameras and lasers to identify its surroundings. You can create a map on the spot and then can decide which is the best path to take to to reach the target. Those sensors are also critical in ensuring the dog reacts to unexpected objects that may cross its path. We can avoid dynamic obstacles, like if some people or some other obstacles show up. And while traditional guide dogs are already helping people with extreme vision loss, Swiss researchers say the pups have their limitations, citing how their robotic dog can be programmed to do specific tasks in unfamiliar places. The team also believes their technology is perfect for blind people who may be allergic to real dogs, but still need assistance getting around. I mean, for some people, they are still a good option, but they are very costly to train, and not all people want to actually have a dog. As researchers continue working on their robot guide dogs, their invention could have real impacts across the country. According to the CDC, roughly 6 million Americans suffer from vision loss, and 1 million are blind. Lauren Green, Fox News.